On Bulls TV, Chuck Swirsky joined by the Bulls draft pick, Jimmy Butler, a young man out of Marquette. And uh, Jimmy, here you are at the Birdos Center. Big smile on your face. Are you ready to rock and roll? I am. Uh, don't know what to expect, but I'm definitely ready to rock and roll. Okay, well, when you say you don't know what to expect, how many NBA games when you were at Marquette, for example, were you able to watch at the Bradley Center to get a feel of the NBA up close and personal? Uh, while I was at Marquette, probably three. I went to probably three Bucks games. And um, when I was working out for Miami, I actually got to uh, catch the Miami Heat and the Chicago Bulls game down in Miami. Really? At that time, did you ever say to yourself, I could see myself as a bull? Uh, I didn't, but I figured I could see myself in the NBA somewhere. You know, what? What I really did think that this system fit me best, the defensive mentality, the way that um, Coach Tibbs is. But I never once was like, okay, that team is the one for me. It was kind of like that team is the best fit for me. But now that I'm here, this is the one. Yeah, now obviously it's very, very early in the situation because training camp hasn't really started yet. So tell me about your off season with the lockout and whatnot. How did you prepare yourself and your body? Just a lot of working out, doing a lot of running, a lot of shooting, ball handling, things like that. But I moved around a lot. I went from Tomball, Texas, where it, which is where I'm from, to Milwaukee, Marquette, Madison with Wesley Matthews, L.A. with Lazar Hayward, right back down to Florida at IMG. So it was a lot of bounce around with a lot of different people, but I definitely stayed in shape, and I just want to be ready. Okay, what advice did these players sell you and give you? Uh, to just be ready to grind. Uh, of course, I'm a rookie, so you're going to be picked on. That was one of the biggest things, but because I'm a rookie, I'm going to have to work that much harder. And they were just saying, you know, don't change. Don't let it in this change you what you want. But at the end of the day, <clears throat> have fun because this is what I love to do. And that's definitely the main thing that I got out of everybody that I talked to. Okay, I, I know expectations. Everyone wants to know what type of player you're going to be and whatnot. Only time will tell on that. But what do you expect from your heart and soul of yourself when you put on a Bulls uniform? To give them my all every day in practice, every day in the film room, every day in the game to, to help my team win. Uh, if that means playing two minutes, if that means playing however many minutes, that, that never really took effect on me. I just want to win games. I just want to help. I just want to contribute in whichever way that may be. So my expectations is for my team to accept me, know that I'm going to play hard, and um, to win a championship. Well, I'll tell you what, you've impressed so many people with the Bulls organization haven't even put a uniform on yet. So we wish you all the best. And we'll uh, make sure and follow your uh, rookie season here on Bulls TV. Thank you. Appreciate it.